Good afternoon. Welcome back to Vitamin B. And today I'm going to talk about the important things you need to train a healthy mind. So let me start with ego. So a lot of us has been thinking ego is like one bad thing for us to have in our lives. And Benjamin Franklin said that a man is wrapped up in himself, makes a very small bundle. Well, all these quotes about ego are always not good. Um, let's just say, for example, another one: ego destroys any relationship. So be a bigger person. Let ego. You know what I'm saying? So, but. From my personal point of view, I think every one of us need a little bit of ego, and you know you just need to balance it out because sometimes when you are trying to achieve something and at the edge of giving up, and that's just a little bit of that ego actually makes you want to keep going. So. Honestly, to train a healthy mind, you don't need to just get rid of ego. Instead, think of a way to balance it out in your life. So you know, having a little bit of ego might help you get better in a way that you would want to strive. You have that ego, you know. I can't lose. I can't give up now. So this balanced ego is good. So just think about it. You need to be aware of it, so it won't eat you up. You get what I'm saying? So that's one. And the second E I'm going to talk about is education. Um, all of these famous people like Mahatma Gandhi, Nelson Mandela, they all talked about education, and we know how important is. Education for us. A lot of the people would stop educating themselves once they finish college, once they finish their university. But you never stop learning. You should never stop learning. I mean, education elevates you, your value. And also,、um, Nelson Mandela said this before: education is one powerful weapon. To change the world, even Mahatma Gandhi said something like that before as well. I can't remember exactly what was it, but just think about it. Formal education, informal education—they're always helping you to elevate yourself. So, to have a healthy mind, you would really need to think about education every day. I mean. You can always start right now. Start today. Every day, you just need to give up maybe what twenty minutes, thirty minutes, and then slowly build up to like an hour a day. Listen to podcasts, watch personal growth videos. I mean, there's so many things out there right now on the internet that you can educate yourself, and that this education are not even boring like. Reading, maybe you thought reading books isn't your thing, but I mean, watching videos. Have you seen Jay Shetty's videos? I mean, he's turning education into entertainment. So all these resources are out there. You just need to go look for them and educate yourself, elevate yourself, and there is one of the ways to train a healthy mind. And now the last E I'm going to talk about is enjoy little things in life. Have you watched the Zombie Land too? Even that Rule Thirty Two is about enjoy little things. I mean, come on, guys. If you want to be living this life and you know complaining about every single thing. How are you ever going to be happy? So why don't you just start paying attention 
being aware, being self-conscious of what's happening around you and be grateful and enjoy all the little things around you. I mean, you walk out your house in the morning and look at the sky and it's not raining. Well, thank God it's a good weather. Enjoy it. And you see the sun? Another thing to be happy about, enjoy the sunlight shining on you. And well, there's so many other things you go, you walk out of your house and you can see someone smiling at you. That's another thing. Enjoy that. All these little things in life, if you pay attention to all this, how can you not feel happy every day? And these are the ways that I want you to be paying attention, be aware of if you want to train a healthy mind. Thank you for listening and please subscribe if you enjoy watching this. Thank you.